I think I can, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. <gasps> faster and faster. Up and up, faster and faster and faster. I've been volunteering here for probably 30 years, more or less. Helping out, just doing volunteer things. and do, I've been doing story time off and on for uh, probably uh, 10 years. There were dolls, dolls with blue eyes and yellow curls. Oh, I see blue eyes. It's just things are changing and my life's changing and we're thinking about moving and I need to downsize. And the funniest little toy clown you ever saw. I was a stay-at-home mom. I worked before I was married and for a short while after I was married, but then I just stayed home with my children. And um, I was fortunate living in Glen Rock because a lot of my friends also had children the same age, so we did a lot of things together. Uh, gradually, over the years, most of the other moms went back to work. So I found my work here. <gasps> it, it's not candy. Thank you, sweetie. It, well, I, I see with my own two children, I saw how important it was that they learned things when they were very, very young. I think it's important for a lot of kids to get some kind of grounding before they go off to kindergarten because so much is expected of them in kindergarten these days. My mother sent me to school to learn how to read. Today, they have to learn to read when they're in preschool. We'll help you home again. What are you going to miss about not volunteering? Books. <laughs> the perks. No, the children. The children. Hi, Katie. How are you? And on coming home, you know, so no matter where we go, all we need is you and me to be as happy as can be. I'll miss you guys.